good morning from the airport. So me and mum, oh my god, I'm losing my voice, are currently in the lounge. Mum has just got some food, let me show you. Oh, let's have a little drop in. Full on fry up for mum. Did they have hash browns? Um, the tiny ones, yeah, baby ones. I'm so excited. Guys, we literally were stuck at security for so long. We were there for about half an hour. My, my liquids needed to be checked and mum left some Laura Mercier body butter in her suitcase and thought she was, well, did you just forget about it? Yeah, it was only a tiny pot, I forgot. Yeah, sneaking more liquids in. Um, so we are sat in the lounge now. It's a bit busy, so um, I'm gonna get my food in a minute. Um, but I'm all prepped for the airport. We've got a bit of a wait now. So um, I'm gonna get some food. I'm all prepped as always. Um, basically, can't go wrong with all the food in the world in here all the drinks in the world so i'm gonna be in my element i've also got my readly app ready to go let me show you so if you are new here um then basically really is something that i use all the time i've got my favorite tabs so i've got like heat new woman all of my favorites um before i go to bed at night if i'm on the train if i'm on my lunch break at work and there's not really much for me to go out and do like in town or anything um so I wanted to share with you guys that my unique link is back. You, you can get two months free and then after that it's 9 99 a month, but you can cancel it at any time. Mum also downloaded it. Yeah. Oh, perfect. <laughs> Mum loves reading all the home magazines. I mean, so do I, I can't lie, but Mum's always there like, what is it? Um, country living and things like that. Mum loves it. Um, but yeah, last time I had this offer was five months ago, I think. So you make the most of it. a load of magazines around. Yeah, it's so much easier. You can just literally download them all on your phone. Newspapers, so when I'm away, I can keep up with what's going on as well. Um, so this one is Heat. I'm gonna insert it on screen so you can see it a bit better. My favorite page is a spotted page where you can see all the celebrities and see where they are. Okay, breakfast is served. I've also got a lemon water and a little rosé. And oh, look at these little hash brown bites. I'm so excited to tuck in. Taking the blazer off, it's a bit hot in here. Um, but yeah, so they also have family sharing. So mum, for example, can use my account. You can have up to five devices on one account. Um, mum certainly makes the most out of that. So let me sit off my... Oh, that is so good. Mum's left me, by the way, I'm sat on my own. I noticed that my sound keeps going in and out, so I need to keep an eye on that whilst I'm away. Um, but yeah, it's a bit annoying. Um, don't know what's going on. As I say, all the information is in my description box. If you've got any questions, let me know. But yeah, I remember at Christmas, I was loving all the um, home ones and the, I think I shared with you, there was like a DIY gifts and things like that, like crafty ones. But at the minute, it's, I'm focusing on summer. Soon it's gonna be all about summer and like summer outfits. I can't wait. Yeah, there's so many magazines on that. There's something for everyone, which I love. So I'm gonna go and find mum now and I will catch up with you later. We made it, his mother. So, um, we, the flight by the way, I ate about another five courses, I had a fry up, and then I had um, croissant and granola and yogurt and champagne and a cup of tea. Anything else? Did I miss anything else? No, I think that was it. They kept saying, you want me to top it up? And I was like, no thanks. Um, so we've just come to sit along the main um, seafront bit because our room isn't ready yet. Um, well, actually we had a room, but it was a double bed and me and mum don't share. <laughs> so we had to Not say- Not we can help. Though. Yeah, we had to say, please we have another one. It's a bit windy. So I don't know if you can hear me, but um, yeah, we're coming to sit here for a little bit. I'm gonna fl flip it around and show you. And then we're gonna go back to the hotel and then sort ourselves out and then I'll fill you in properly on our plans. Um, but it's so beautiful, it's so nice to have a bit of sun. Look at this. It's so pretty. It actually feels really quite warm. Like a lot of people have jackets on, don't they? But I actually think I could probably sit in a t-shirt. Oh, I don't think we need it. I think, yeah, I, th I feel like maybe the people that live here feel like it, this is cold to them, isn't it? But to us coming from England, it's bloody a lot warmer than it is. It's far warmer over here than it is in England. Okay, so our little sit down was short lived because we're now off to hunt down and try our very first matcha. 
so we saw this um a girl's vlog who came here like in summer and she was like if you go to this place you need to try matcha so we were like okay um if you go to nice you need to go to this place and ask for a matcha special i think that's what it's called yeah so it's a 15 minute walk but we've got two hours until our room's ready anyway so we're gonna head there now we've not had lunch although i'm gonna be honest I'm very much full up i have to say <laughs> i'm not excited just, just looking at it for the matcha i know yeah. it's never really been something Everyone, i think i can everyone. get on board with i've never Raised tried it um, but we're gonna go and hunt down a matcha so we'll keep you posted and then we we don't know where, where we're going for dinner tonight but as you can tell i'm already thinking about it even though i've had about 10 calls <laughs> I didn't actually. You did. She actually. She actually. Yeah. You just had a croissant and a coffee, and there's me like, yeah, I have the full English. I bet the air thought, oh, there's always one. There's always one that wants the full English. It was nice though, I have to say. Um, it looked alright. Yeah, it was nice. It looked a lot nicer than the food we had at home yesterday. Oh, that's a whole other story. My family will know what we're talking about. But we had a disastrous Mother's Day meal yesterday, guys. Uh, the food was horrendous. We ended up getting a full refund. Would not recommend anyone to go to the place that we went to. But that's for and another day. <laughs> where did we end up going? Three, two, one, McDonald's. Oh <laughs> and it was ten times nicer with amazing oh customer service. So, you know. Also, what did we spot at the airport, Mum? What Tell them. Who? What did you spot at the airport? Oh. Joe and the Juice. Joe and the Juice. We've got yes. to hunt one down. See now. When we fly I'm home, converted, Joe yeah. and the Juice. I thought you were on about. Mum's. Oh, you were on about the celeb spotting that we were up to. Um, oh. my arms aching, guys. I'm gonna have to put you down for a minute. Uh, guys, the smile on my face is really not okay. Um, but I'm so oily. They're a napkin. Guys, it took us like 20 minutes to get here, and then I think I've messed up really because I I've got a hot match. Is that right? It's like. No. Not what I thought. So, um, I think I'm already. I think we're going to try one from the logo right now. Let's just try it anyway. Here it goes. Bird. It just tastes a bit like tea. With a load of salt on it. It looks like peas. It looks like peas, right? Let's try it. I actually really like it. Hmm? I like that. Mum's gonna, I'm gonna make mum try it. Go on. Mum's got a juice. Try some. The pressure's on. No. Oh, I won't like it. She probably really won't like it. It's not bad, is it? I quite like that. Do you? Mm. I won't like it. <laughs> It honestly tastes, it doesn't really taste so much, does it? It does. Oh, it's going to be for a second one. I'm not sure what it tastes of that. I can't really watch nice. guys, please tell me if you're meant to have a hot dog. It's really embarrassing. Oh, mum's a fan. Matcha, I never thought I'd see the deck. But they might not I'm taste like that now. everywhere. Match a girl now. <laughs> they might not taste like that everywhere. They may not. Okay, we have made it to our room, guys. It's actually hilarious. I think I said earlier about the twin room situation. They only had double beds. Although that bed is definitely bigger than the one in the last room. Um so they've that is definitely bigger, um, yeah. So anyway, this is Mum's amazing little bed, and look at mine. Wow. Because she wouldn't share a bed with me, although I don't, wouldn't, wouldn't really want to share, share with her. Me. No, we don't get on if we share the same room. But we've got a little balcony, which we didn't have in the last room, little coffee machine, telly. I'll leave the link to the hotel oh. below. There's a little curtain to pull aside when you don't want to see all your stuff. And then here is the bathroom. Oh yes, there's a bath, which makes me happy. And a shower, obviously. And there's me again. Guys, I'm sorry, I just had to pick up the camera. So we were just like looking out on our balcony and there was a bit of drama going on. There was like someone shouting. Anyway, came back in, <laughs> literally. I kid you not, there was a siren. Mum has literally bolted out the door. She was like, like trying to see what's happening. So let me, I'm following her out. Full alarm. Full alarm. For God's sake, you literally bolted out there. I thought we were going to be in for some like, not road wars, but what's it called? What's it called? 24 hours in police, police custody. Back on tonight. Tonight? Tomorrow night. Look at us on our little French balcony. Down there, look. 
cozy in my pajamas. My really comfy pajamas. Guys, here she is. <laughs> she had her nap and went and had a bath and I literally walked into the bathroom and there was the, the floor was like flooded and I was like, what is going on? There was, mum basically washed her hair in the bath, flooded it and it landed all over her pajamas to the point where I picked them up and they're dripping. Let me show you. It's not even funny. It is hilarious, I'm sorry. <laughs> She's got nothing to put on. No, <laughs> Look, they're literally drying on the balcony. Uh, and they're not even going to dry because it's the temperature's dropped now. Um, so <laughs> you've got nothing. <laughs> that hair dryer. What's with that hair dryer? <laughs> it's one of these hair dryers. Oh look at her with her rollers in. Just ignore her, guys. She literally, she's having a bit of a moment. She was like, you know, any normal daughter, you know, would give me their pajamas. I was like, absolutely not. I've got nothing to put on if I give you mine. So she's going to have to get the hair dryer on her pajamas. Yeah, but you take the finger off the button. And it's oh yeah, it's one of these ones that you have to hold down the whole time, oh. so you've got cramp by the end of it. Anyway, we are going to get ready to go out for dinner. Sooner um, rather than later. Now I've got no pajamas. This towel's so tough. <laughs> I don't know what's happened. I don't know what's going on Is with her. The floor as well. No. Ta da! Little. That wasn't even a transition, so I don't know why I was going to say it was. Um, so we are ready to go out for dinner. I've put these little clips in that my friend Nat got me for my birthday. But I'm wearing a bodysuit and some lipsy um, trousers. I was going to wear heels, but guys, we're 9,000 steps in as it is. And um, we don't know where we're going for dinner yet, do we? No. I mean, mum looks like she's absolutely ready to go out right this second. It's entertainment in itself coming away with her. Um, so yeah, we're gonna head out now and go and hunt down some food. I'm really hungry, so I'm craving like oh my, three I'm courses. Starving. I want three courses. Oh no, I couldn't do that. Oh no, I can't do that. <laughs> <laughs> I could. Um, so yeah, we will see you. So yeah, we're gonna go and find somewhere now. Is it dark now? Um, oh. Still like we're gonna go out at the perfect time. Um, like this at home next this time next Sunday. Yeah, I'm Clops, buzzing for the that. Clocks go, go forward. Yeah. Um, I'm also excited to come back because downstairs is a hot chocolate. Um, no, no, it's basically whatever drink you want from a machine, 24 hours a day. So I said to Mum, we can come up for a hot chocolate. That was a lovely little um, bowl that I just let out there. Um, so yeah. There's one thing I say is missing from this hotel. Oh, here we go. What's missing then? Biscuits. <laughs> Bearing in mind we were in the supermarket earlier and I said, do you want some snacks? Yeah, Let's get some biscuits then. We've got a lovely little coffee. Machine. I need to get dry shampoo, so if we hurry up, we can get some biscuits. No biscuits. Oh, and no rope. Oh, she's furious that there's no dark bathroom. <laughs> oh, I don't know why you have to sleep naked. That, that teacher says you're right for having a bloody swimming marathon in the bath. <laughs> I, I can't believe there was water was. everywhere. I didn't even hear I a noise. Knock something over, but it was obviously a tidal wave. Tidal wave. You couldn't write it. Um, right, let's go. Let's go, guys. We found a really cute restaurant for dinner. There's Mum. <laughs> I'm, I'm just eyeing up the menu, but yeah, we've got a really cute restaurant. We've got some olives and nuts, and then we'll order our food in a minute. But I'm going to go for pasta, I think. Yeah. Cocktails have arrived. Mum's got a non-alcoholic peanut and I've got a sex on the beach. Cheers! Ooh, ooh, Mum's gonna taste some. Is it good? I this all the time. It, yeah, you did on a holiday, yeah. I'm gonna taste mine. Hang on, let me flip you around. Oh, so good. There's a bit of music in here, guys, so I can't really vlog that much. So I'm gonna just do like, I'll include a few clips, and I'll do like a like music over it. There's my telecrux on the pudding menu, and I'm so excited. And I've also got. Um, I went for pizza, and Mum went for chicken kebab. Yeah, so I went for a chicken kebab. Mum's kebab. Look at the size of my pizza. So excited for this. Can we just evaluate the size of this crap? Oh my god! Look at that. Is that how they look? Yeah. Look at this. Nutella, by the way. Good evening. That food was so good. I'm so full up, but I still managed my crap. I had a cocktail. 
um, and then I had a coffee as well. <laughs> Could not be any more full if I tried right now. So we are back in the room. We literally have been up. It's, I'm vlogging. It's like 9.45 and we've been up since, I went to bed at half 12 a.m. and got up at 3.45 a.m. And I haven't napped at all. Mum did have a nap, I didn't. So um, yeah, we've come back because we've got an early start tomorrow because we want to go to Monaco. Hopefully you've just heard all of that, but basically I was just saying we've had like no sleep. I don't know if it cut out the sound. So we've come back very full um, and we are going to Monaco bright and early tomorrow on the train, I believe, providing there's no like strike action because there has been strikes here as well this weekend. So yeah, bright and early start for that, I'm so excited. That's gonna be like a come to Monaco with me vlog, I think if there's enough to vlog, or it will just be within this vlog. Either way, you'll know, so I don't mind too much. <laughs> She's just gone flying across the room. What is wrong with you? Yeah, because I'm unpacking. Oh my God, honestly. She's <laughs> nearly roly polied on the floor. That's the third time you've tripped over today. Yeah, that's it now. It's easy now goodness me so um i will <laughs> so i will catch up with you guys in the morning hey guys so we are just walking to get some breakfast then we're going to find the train station and head on the train apparently it's a really scenic route so i'm very excited and it's actually really warm i've just got my little crop blazer on and trousers straight down unless you find anywhere that we can go for breakfast um yeah so we're just going to find somewhere to go and then I'll take you with us, but I'm so excited. I've never been there before and I've wanted to go for so long. So yeah, it's actually really nice and warm, which is always a bonus. Here's the station. Very fancy compared to our uh, stations in London. Well, some of them, some of them are a bit like this, but so nice. We're gonna go and get our tickets now. I think it's eight euros, but I'll let you know in a minute. Um, it's so sunny as well. Look. I don't think you can see how pretty these buildings are. Here we go. We are platform D. Guys, this station is massive. Uh, yeah, plat oh my God, they're double-decker trains. How cool is that? Yeah, it says access to all, to all trains. I'm not sure, but it's very cool. Oh, they've got little vending machines. We love to see it. Me and mum just found some cats. Oh, wow. After, after, after searching for them. This, you, you were convinced they were in the bin. Yeah, I was convinced that we had to go and rescue a little cat from a bin. Turns out they were just with its owner in a cage. I think that's me catastrophizing the poor cat's life. I know, but I can't just sit there and listen to it. I know, it was really... investigating. Right, we are going to platform D. Guys, our train tickets are like boarding passes. So cool. Here they are. Here they are, look at these. Proper boarding passes. Let's go to Monaco. Here's our train. I think it's one of the double-decker ones, you know. Not that we'll be upstairs. I look like such a tourist right now. Of course, we got a window seat. I was so happy because the train's actually really busy. Um, look at these cute little French buildings. Oh, look at the little shutters. It was 17 euros return total so really worth doing if you're coming to Nice and you want to go to Monaco on the way back if it's not dark depending on what time we come back we'll show you upstairs wow this is actually incredible basically taking you on a tour of our train journey look how pretty that is here we go. Everything just looks stunning. Look. Welcome to Monaco, guys. Ah, I'm so excited. Right, so me and Mum have absolutely no idea where we're going, but that's all part of it. Oh, what a coincidence. On our walk down, we have come across <laughs> our favorite store, AKA Zara. There's, this is the designer quarter. There's YSL, there's Dior, Balenciaga, etc. Guys, Zara is so much better abroad. Look at this really pretty place here. 
and this little cropped jacket, I love that. I feel they always have cuter bits. I'm sure some of it's the same, but oh, this white top. Can I have it all please? Thank you. <laughs> oh my God, the swimwear. Oh, I love that. Okay, we're on our way down to the sea. I say the sea, I, just the front bit. Oh, stop by Dior. All the buildings just look 10 times better, don't they? All the buildings look 10 times better. It's very hilly, that's one thing that um, I have noticed. You've got to be prepared to walk when you come here. Look at mum. Are you loving it? <laughs> it's beautiful, it's really warm here, isn't it? Guys, honestly, it's, I can't describe how picturesque and like, oh, this is beautiful. I'm going to zoom in because look at that. Oh. Okay, so we're just going to go for a little wonder. I don't know where we're going to have lunch yet. Oh, Gucci. Maybe I should take my sliders and say, do you want them back? Yeah. <laughs> They're very uncomfortable. And they scuffed. Oh yeah, and they scuffed first at use, which isn't very helpful. There's so many boats here. I feel like everyone as well is so like fashionable. There's been a lot of girls walking around with Chanel bags. Look down there. Just let me know when I can move in to be honest. I hope you can see okay, but we are at the casino. I'm just trying to go closer so you can see. Look at all the palm trees basically surrounded by all the high-end stores. There's cute little areas that you can have lunch. So hopefully we can go into one of them. I don't know if you have to book, but anyway, look at that. Stunning. Okay guys, I'm gonna merge all this footage into one because I was gonna do a separate Monaco vlog, but to be completely honest, it, there's so much walking around, I just feel like you'd have got bored. Um, so I've merged it all into one. We are just about to get the train back. I got a little very, very drink. Oh my god, I wish I had that in the UK. Mum got a frap. Uh, so we're just waiting for our train back and then we're going to go for lunch on the seafront in Nice because we're walking around for ages um, and everything was really busy and also nothing that really took my fancy. We found like an Italian but I was looking at the menu and it was not great. So we're going to head back to Nice. So I'll see you when we get back. Hopefully on the train we're going to get upstairs. Um, or at least so I can show you the scenic sea route on the way back, if that makes sense. Um, so we'll see you when we get back. Guys, we got the right seat. Look at the view. It's a bit difficult because the glass is reflecting, but this is basically all we can see the whole way back. Okay, I can see why people decide to get the train because this is honestly beautiful. Me and mum watched a vlog before, like I mentioned, and <laughs> the poor guy like um, basically didn't vlog anything when he got there, just the train, and I feel like I can see why, because it's just speechless, like when you're on this train. And also the sea looks really crystal clear. Um, and then up here you've got some more buildings, some houses and things. Oh, it's a bit hard because the screen glares, but let me show you when we're on the move. Look at all those boats. Oh my god guys, what a dreamy beach spot. So we're back in Nice, as I think I already said. Just found this gorgeous place on the beach. I think this is the name of it. I'll link it below anyway. But look at the view. Did you just say cheers? Oh, let's try. We'll do a proper cheers, guys. Cheers. I've got a sex on the beach. Oh, that is nice. Me and mum have decided that we want to come back in summer as well. It's really warm out here. I've taken my blazer off, as you 
as you can see. Um, but I would like to come back here in the summer. I bet it gets so busy everywhere, but you'd have to book. Um, I've ordered pe yeah. I've ordered pesto pasta, and Mum's ordered steak. Oh, I'm gonna get crossfaded. Um, I'll show you our food when it arrives. I'm so excited for that pesto pasta, and Mum's got a big old ribeye ribeye steak, and then we've got some bread. We have just finished dinner lunch um i was gonna get a pudding but i was so full up i yes. didn't how good was that uh well my pass was amazing how oh, good was yours i had a good bite to take <sighs> it was it so was good delicious. i've just realized we're going that way aren't we yeah, yeah. Going so um we're now going to go and get some ice cream because i was too full up for pudding but i feel like i need to oh there's a cyclist i need to like walk it off and then and i'll have a pudding i had a nice I know mum, for the first time in a long time, had a Kiwi Royale. Oh, she doesn't drink. Champagne. Yeah, you liked it though, didn't you? Yeah, it was very nice. And I had a, just crossing the road. Oh, oh, thanks. <laughs> I had a Sex on the Beach cocktail. It was lovely. Uh, what way do you want to go? Should we walk up a bit? Yeah. I don't know where we're going to go tonight now, That's but. That's a nice one. Oh, it's like mine. Um, I don't know where we're going to go tonight but my goodness before I can eat tonight I need to burn off some serious calories because I'm so oh, full up Woo. what a nice lunch though it was so nice I was also quite happy because a lady asked where my trousers were from earlier and I was like oh they're just Primark why is it when people say that where it's like oh it's only Primark um but yeah that's the plan now go for a little walk I really like the look of this hotel it's called Le Royal let me show you These look lovely so i really hope i'm in focus because my camera's been playing me but yeah i'm gonna go for a little walk now and find maybe an ice cream spot or something similar okay so we said we we're full up about five minutes ago <laughs> look we stopped off at an ice cream parlor so i've got bueno flavor and mum's got tropical and bubble gum but i'm convinced that the blue one is bubble gum as well so i don't know what flavor she's ended up with um, but I went for Bueno, so we're now walking back to the seafront, sit and eat our ice cream, and then we're going to go for an explore, but I find it hilarious that I said I was full up. I can live out here though, guys, honestly. It's so nice. Where's the not too So many spread out. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're going to find a cute little spot. I've never tried Bueno ice cream, but I, um, I imagine it's quite nice. I also want to take my blazer off because I'm a little bit hot. Is the blue one nice? Isn't it bubblegum? I'm not sure. I'm so confused because the pink one says bubblegum and the blue one says... The pink one is just like the... What was that bubblegum we used to get called? Oh. Bubba Bubba. Oh really? So yeah. it's pink bubblegum and blue bubblegum. <laughs> That's what my prediction is. Um, I want to try my bueno. When I sit down I'll try it. Can you feed me a bit of this bueno one so I can quickly show them my taste test? Oh my god, very hazelnutty, as you'd expect with a um, bueno. Oh, so good. Right, to find a seat. Featuring the sea view. Very the nice. The lady moves, so now we're stuck together. Yippee! <laughs> we should have laughed, but this would actually only happen to us. Yeah, have you moved the obstacle course as well, please? Hang on a minute. Oh, honestly, so mum woke up from a nap and um, <laughs> basically, long <laughs> story short, I don't think. Basically, I don't know where we're going to go this evening because um, mum's. Something has to be with me. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> Something's not agreed with her, okay? So, you know, it, it was a bit of touch and go. <laughs> well, especially with the assault course on the way to the bathroom. The assault course being my suitcase. Focus is really playing me today. Um, so, yeah. There may not be a fancy dinner this evening. Well, I'm not sitting in at all, Um, There's also nothing to do in this room, so tonight's going to be interesting. 
I have just discovered like a whole new area that we haven't been to yet. So hopefully we're going to go there tomorrow. Um, oh, not forgetting the shoe situation because mum's only bought trainers or heels and her trainers are have like rubbed her feet to shreds. How can you get sore feet from trainers? Because we've done like 20,000 steps or something crazy. So yeah, basically, uh, we mum was like, I think we need to, you know, wait till at least half seven, quarter to eight. And it's currently 20 to seven. So we're just going to be in the room for the next few, well, the next hour, basically. Oh, oh, oh. So I thought I'd better update you because um, we I just don't know what the footage is going to be this evening, to be honest. Okay, so... <laughs> little update I'm back in the outfit I wore earlier because mum still doesn't feel great and I don't want to waste a nice outfit that I can save for tomorrow so I think we're just literally well I don't think mum's gonna eat and I'm literally just gonna go and grab something quick whether that be like something to take away I don't know where my phone is what's the time mum um, what's the time uh, it's half eight I'm not particularly hungry, um, but yeah, mum, <laughs> she's trying, but it's, I just don't think it's a good idea that we go out for dinner. So um, I am gonna get grab something quick, um, and then I think tomorrow we'll be up early and go and like explore for our last like full day and hopefully she feels better. Oh, and just to top things off, my straighteners, just plug them in and they're going beep, 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 beep which hasn't happened in the whole time I've been here. So I don't know if something's wrong with the plug or if they're breaking, which I'm praying those are not the case because I could do without that that happening before I even get home. Um, so yeah, so I'm gonna hunt down a takeaway. I'm gonna ask the reception, you can see mum in the mirror in the background with her roller in. <laughs> I'm gonna ask the reception if they can recommend any good takeaways or I could even get Uber Eats, but we don't wanna sit in this room because we're like, <laughs> There's nothing to do in here, is there? No, we've got one channel. Yeah, one English channel. BBC World News. BBC World News. And we don't want to sit and watch the news the whole time, so... Even if you just go for a little walk as well, it'd be nice. Yeah, just a nice walk. I didn't want to... Excuse my hair. I didn't want to change my outfit because I was going to, but I'm going to save it for tomorrow. Guys, I've decided I'm going to start speaking French. It's just such a, like, you know, mm, come see, come see, kind of like... What is it? What is it? Bonsoir. 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 Good um, evening. Au revoir. You know three words. Not. Anyway, basically, the You're reality French is. French at school. Mm, comme si, comme ça. I think that means I'm okay. I'm, I'm not. I'm not bad. I'm not okay. Um, guys, in all seriousness, look, why am I eyes still watching? Because I'm laughing at my own joke. But basically, I was just saying to Mum, mm, I'm going to start speak French, and then I remember I just need to get Rosetta, Rosetta Stone. Is it Rosetta Stone? The tape. Bonjour. Yeah, about Bonjour. 15 years ago. Oh, <laughs> whatever it is. If any of you guys can speak French, hook no, me up. You did Latin at school. No, I did Spanish and I was very you good at Spanish. Which is also why I said hola. <laughs> Gracias to somebody earlier. And we just come across some really cute little yeah, bistro. And then you went to um, Mum, look how beautiful that is. Guys, I'm going to flip you around and stop wittering for you because I know you're probably sick of me. Bear with. A very cute little bistro. How pretty is that? <laughs> just seen a mum has just seen a look like of Prince William. Like to the point where it actually really did look like him. I was just about I to dared mum to go over there. <laughs> like, oh, where's Catherine? I was um, gonna curtsy. So, oh, sorry, your highness, my mistake. It's so this is where we went last night. Right, guys, the place that we went to last night is called Shay Mor Mori. Mori. Shay. <laughs> What's that song? That's a Maury. <laughs> um, Shay Maury. Maury's. Johnny yeah. Marie. Johnny. <laughs> 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 right, this is the place. There you go. Do you remember that? <laughs> Catherine's here when she goes, Johnny. <laughs> I'm crying. Why do we find ourselves so funny? I've not even had any drinking. There's no drinking involved. It's just me clowning around in the middle of, I was about to say Paris. When she went to the doctor. Where are we? Nice. There we go. I forgot for a second. You are? <laughs> Is it emergency? What's going to do with you? <laughs> mum's now, right anyway, sorry. Mum's now wording Catherine Tate. Um, <clears throat> gonna, uh, well, that's the hotel over there. Um, we picked up some snacks from the shop as well, so... <clears throat> but I only got Pringles and I want some chocolate, but anyway. I will catch up with you in the morning when hopefully I've calmed down. 
last day outfit. Got my Zara jeans on, Axel trainers, Zara top, um, head to toe Zara basically, um, Primark sunnies. But guys, the straighteners are broke. They are well and truly broken, so the hair is ratty, ratty vibes today. Um, Mum is, I've just realised she's in her bra, so I better not show. She's um, packing away, and my case is down there. So we're gonna head out, get some breakfast, and go and explore before we have to leave to go to the airport. But we don't have to leave until much later this afternoon, so um, yeah, let me just show you properly in here, because the lighting's a bit rubbish. There you go, there's the outfit. Ready to go. Okay, we found a cute little breakfast spot. Look at this view. So we're right opposite the beach, basically. Um, so, I don't know, they do like Nutella pancakes, which is really what's calling me. I'm gonna have. What are you gonna have? I'm gonna They also do like croissants, toast, or avocado. What are you having? The English. The English. Oh, so there's packages. So yeah. the English is orange juice, fried eggs, salmon or bacon, emmental cheese on farmhouse bread, and then a hot drink of your choice. But I think I'm gonna have the American, which is granola yogurt and then Nutella pancakes. Basically, very unhealthy. But it's fine. Uh, nearly. Here we go. I've got this like iced chocolate thing. Mum's this got an orange amazing. juice. It's, well, it's just fresh these sweets. I've got an iced chocolate thing. Let me show you. You wouldn't like it though because it's got bits in it. Oh my god, that is like a Nesquik, basically. Yeah. yeah, it's really good. And then I've got Nutella and banana on toast and mum's got, what did you order? The English. So I've got slushy squeezed on fried egg, bacon. On bread. Yeah. Bacon and egg, basically. It's so warm sat here, it's lovely. Look at mum's, she's got an absolute feast. And look at mine. I am so excited for this. There's also extra Nutella there. I think that's meant to be mum's, but I might steal it if I need to. Breakfast is done. I just wanted to show you this little bit because I thought it looked really pretty. So this is all along the main road. I forget the name of it. Um, and there's like a little statue kind of thing over there. Some more hotels. And then obviously out to the sea. So we're just going for a little walk now. We haven't been over this side yet, so we thought we'd have a little wonder. Oh look, there's a little train, the little tourist train. <laughs> over there, we should have gone on that. Can you see it? Yeah. And there's a carousel. I might go on the rides. <laughs> um, yeah, so we're just gonna have a little wonder and see where the day takes us. There's a little hop on tour. Same as what we have in London. We've not been down this way before, so we're just gonna have a little wonder. I was about to start vlogging with um, some lady next to me. <laughs> Did you miss that? I thought that lady was you, so I started to like lean her into the camera like, oh, what this were you gonna say? What's wrong, I bet they all run upstairs. Oh yeah, I'd love to go upstairs on the, If you're going on a double-decker bus and it's warm outside, you've got to go upstairs. It's a bit noisy around this, uh, this, this area. So you may not hear me, but I want to show you something when we get a bit further ahead. Um, so we've got like, five hours until we need to go to the airport. I'm already thinking about what I'm eating again at the airport and on the plane. What is wrong with me? You wouldn't think I've got to film oh, some try-on clips for lounge when I get back tomorrow. <laughs> so if I'm looking a little bit on the um, fluffy Lovely. side, it's the Nutella and bananas. <gasps> We've got to find the eclairs. We've got oh, to find I the eclairs. Where they were. I, I yeah, know I exactly where they are. By the match, right? Yeah. By Cafe Fee. Yeah. How inconsiderate. Look how pretty. Okay, so this is what we're walking towards. This is what I wanted to show you. Yeah, I, th I don't. <laughs> what do you expect? Oh. Mum was going to take a seat. I thought, mm, yeah, probably best not. No, mum's I'm got a dirty there. mind as always. This is so stunning because look, you've got this, and then I don't know if you can see down here, but there's like a little hill. Let me zoom in. And all you can see is like all the little buildings. If you ever get the chance to come to Nice, please do it. Pardon? Where's the tram? Oh. Oh, there she is. Coming towards us. 
We're gonna head down this way in a minute because uh, I recognize where we are now. These cafes are so pretty. I honestly feel like I found my happy place. Like I used to say, I used to think it was Ibiza. Dubai is obviously one of my favorites, but this place is so close to home. So I feel like you need to come and make the most of things that are a lot nearer on, on your doorstep. Guys, we've come back to the beach we were on yesterday where we had lunch and going to the beachy drink side of it because we're just gonna sit here and have a little drink. There was a bit of a saga with the eclair shop, wasn't there? Mum's very disappointed because they didn't have any eclairs. And then every other bakery we did we went to didn't have any either, so she's a bit heartbroken at the moment. <laughs> what did you say? It's weird that they didn't. It is weird. They didn't have any eclairs or sort of caramel eclairs or anything, so disappointing to say the least. So we've come down to the beach instead. I've gone for a little iced coffee. I actually had a chocolate shake for breakfast with my Nutella and I feel like I should have maybe gone for like a wine or something but it's fine look at us just being ladies of leisure mum's got her OJ <laughs> um I don't know what we're gonna have for lunch what are you thinking I don't actually know are you still full up I'm just gonna pan over here because that zoom if I zoom in hopefully my camera doesn't blur it too much it's so pretty but I feel like the camera just doesn't do it justice guys we have news for you i don't know how it's taken us three days to figure this out oh there is a bakery opposite our hotel that does you know pasta sandwiches baguettes bacon this morning. but most importantly mini chocolate eclairs Woo! two euros so we got them they're not the salted caramel ones but they are chocolate ones so we're going to try one one each um very very excited absolutely love that. Let's go on the red ones. <laughs> Our seats got st stolen. Um, so yeah, I am so happy that we finally got them. Here she goes. She's gone in. Oh, is it got chocolate cream in the middle? Oh my god. Is it nice? Oh no. After all that, she doesn't like it. Are you joking? Oh no. Oh, <laughs> I was going to say, I was like, oh, kidding me. She's a fan. I'm gonna try mine. Big one. Is it sickly? Look at that melted chocolate drip. I'm gonna I'm gonna give mine a go. I can't film and um, try it at the same time, so bear with. Mmm. Mm-mm. Oh, that is good. Very light. Well done. We're at the airport in the lounge area. There's mum. <laughs> um, so I've just got a glass of rosé and some chocolate mousse. Oh. Chocolate mousse as a little sweet treat. We've got quite a few hours before we fly, so it's quite nice to just relax. We've got three hours. It's quite a long time. Um, so yeah, we're just going to relax here and then fly home. I kind of wish I brought a book with me, you know. I've got a French book. Get starting with my language. Tra 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 training myself to speak French. But um, yeah, it's really cute. So we're just going to relax here. Did have a quick look at the shops. So there wasn't really anything going on. Um, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Um, if it was a bit all over the place, I apologise. Uh, but thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.